here comes the Odds Eye Corman train. Also, something I'm going to point out, those lights are not original to the railroad crossing. Yes, those are old school signal things with the mechanical bell, but I remember before that, I can remember when they put them there. for a second there, it looks like his truck. I didn't get it, but the car just went speeding across the crossing as soon as the last car of the train cleared. I don't think the last car of the train's already crossed, but that car kept going. That was kind of funny. <laughs> I, I like to point out this stretch of the Sucre, of the Sucre Creek Spur is maybe less than 20 miles, less than 30 miles old. Everything here is practically brand new. Apparently in the late 90s, CSX removed all of this. Then they leased it to R.J. Corman, who rebuilt all of it. I think in 2006, R.J. Corman rebuilt all this, but it used to be the trains would come through Mount Hope when I was growing up. They went as far as the Georgia Pacific, but they never went past the Georgia Pacific. So about the tracks dead ended 30 feet from the tunnel. And sometime, I think it's 2006 was the year they rebuilt all this. I saw what creek this is. It's not Circle Creek though, the spur is called the Circle Creek Spur, but Circle Creek comes off the mountain on one side of the tunnel and goes through Mount Hope. On the pack side of the tunnel, I'm not sure what the name of the creek is. I know Circle Creek's on the Mount Hope side of the tunnel. <laughs> 